My name is Michael Reddick, and I'm a McCormick Senior majoring in Chemical Engineering at Northwestern University. When I first joined Professor Tile's lab, I didn't know very much about how research works. Uh, I didn't really understand the process. Uh, but through time, I, I came to understand that research uh, is a very slow-moving process, and you have to work in baby steps to arrive to the final goal. So it requires a lot of patience and determination. Um, but I also realized that it's something I'm very interested in because the final result is very rewarding. I think it's very exciting to be the one who's making the discoveries that you can see other people such as doctors applying in their respective fields. In my lab we study uh, important challenges around making sustainable fuels and chemicals as well as making uh, drugs and diagnostics for low-income countries. Michael is one of five undergrads in the lab and they really work on a variety of projects. Uh, typically they'll be paired with a PhD student uh, and, but oftentimes uh, they'll develop a, a project on their own that's sort of an offshoot of a, of a larger project. So uh, they're really involved in, in the gamut of things we do from uh, making proteins which can be used as a drug to, to making small molecule drugs or fuels uh, or in Michael's case uh, working on the yeast diagnostic project. In Professor Tile's lab, we work with microbes such as yeast and E. coli, and we engineer them to do useful things. Um, uh, for example, we are interested in using yeast as a biological diagnostic. If you have a blood sample that contains HIV proteins, we can rewire the yeast such that it will give a certain output or response when it detects this protein. Michael is a really special student, uh, and he uh, has has really taken on a, a several projects in very different areas. So I think Michael is uh, brave in the sense that he's always up for any challenge that I give him. Uh, he's very resourceful, he's done computational as well as experimental things. Uh, and I'm very excited to see what he'll do in the future. And I, I definitely hope that uh, the training experience he's had in the lab will, will help him there.